Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel and welcome to the 93 rated Baresi player review video. We are looking at Baresi today. Baresi who played alongside Madlini uh, to form just one of the best defensive duos of, of pretty much of, of all time, if not the best of all time. Uh, Baresi gets himself a pretty, well, he's had himself a 93 rated icon card. Medium high work rate, which is very nice for a center back, three star weak foot, which is also very nice for a center back. His in games, of course, defensively, he's perfect. He's pretty much perfect defensively. I mean, 95, 90, 95, 95, 96 is pretty crazy. Uh, physically, he's not too terrible. He's okay. Uh, I'm not going to say it's great, but it's not bad at all. He's It's okay. He's not too bad. How tall is he? Uh, oh, he's 5'9. So, not too bad. Uh, dribbling stats actually very good for a center back very nice agility and balance combination reactions are phenomenal at 93 very good ball control very nice composure as well so he's going to feel a little bit faster than what uh, the stats suggest because of that very good agility and balance passing phenomenal as well a nice combo there and and, and we, get, we get to the bad part right we get to the pretty iffy part it's that pace it's that the pace split is, is a 10 difference on the pace split he only has 64 acceleration, 74 sprint street. Of course, you do want to actually, I was going to say you do want to put a shadow on this guy, but I don't even know if you want to put, I mean, his defensive stats are just maxed out. Why the heck would you want to put a shadow on him? Uh, I mean, a catalyst, I guess, just to increase the passing a little, not that he needs it anyways, uh, but a hunter to increase the finishing. I mean, I don't know. I don't know what to, just put something, either a catalyst or shadow, honestly. Catalyst, shadow, or hunter. Just work on the pace. Get the, just max out the pace as much as you can. In previous years, you know, the shadow could make a difference because when it used to be 15 acceleration, but it's not anymore. It's only 10 and 10. So we're going to try him out. Try him out center back. Team did, well, team player, solid player as well. There's his profile in case you guys want to read it. So let's try him out. Let's see how he is. Let's see how he plays. I'm worried about the acceleration. Let's see how much it affects him. Come on, Baresi. Come on, Baresi. I believe in you. I believe in you. Give him that space. Give him that space. Okay. It's not supposed to happen. Uh, he just got beat tremendously. That's a uh, terrible defending on my part. Wow. Good, but is he finally, man? Jesus Christ, dude, finally. Come on, but is he? Let me switch to but is he? Oh my God, game. Why? I don't know if it's but is he? Or the game? I know it's definitely the game. But for some reason, when I every time I tackle with Baresi, the ball just goes straight back to the opponent. He can't. He tackles it, but I guess he can't win the possession. If that makes any sense whatsoever. Yeah, yeah. That's exactly what I'm talking about right there. Please, please, game, please. Come on, Baresi. Okay, all right, just all right. Nice, Baresi. Thank you. You finally did something useful. Thank you. Yeah, it's a it's a for performance to forget by Baresi. Um, for okay, he did win four possessions, um, but it just seemed like every time I tackled the ball with him, it just went back to my opponent. All right, here we go, opponent. Uh, oh, okay, all right, all right, another freaking sweat squad. Oh, Jesus Christ, this is going to be horrible for Baresi. Those just going to run circles around him. Whatever. But I see, it's all you right now, boy. It's all you, man. Okay, just, all right. Come on. There we go. Good tackle. Finally, we won one. <laughs> we got the tackle. It actually kept the ball. You know, but this isn't terrible. One thing I will say about him is his passing is superb. Um, defensively, he's just, <laughs> he's he's not that bad. It's, it's, on, it's honestly just the acceleration with this card. That is honestly the biggest problem with it. It's just his acceleration. Defensively, he's not even terrible, honestly. Very, very nice. All right, so the guy left. Uh, the one, to, just another quiet game for Baresi. One possession, one. Just not getting enough highlights with him right now, man. All right, we go again. Oh Jesus Christ! Everybody, oh, geez, oh this Coutinho is so annoying to play against. Okay, we're just gonna go play another game with Baresi because just not getting enough highlights for them, and I'm just not really sure right now if he's just really bad or just okay. Good Baresi, good, yeah, good, good, good marking right there. Stay with him. Stay with him. Oh, he 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 does feel good though. Like the movement and stuff, like he 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 feels really nice. Again, it's that good agility and balance. Uh, that's why he feels very like smooth and stuff. Good marking, but I see his marking is phenomenal. I'll I'll give him credit for that because that marking is beautiful. Defensively, let's see what you can do on this one on ones. Nope. <laughs> nice, nice. 
it's good dribbling. It's your time to shine, man. It's your time to shine, man. Okay, so now I'm gonna get to that. Oh, he still got it. Shoot it, shoot it. Go, go, go. But I see. <laughs> nice. Nice, nice, good read. No acceleration, can't get to that, unfortunately. You got it, you got it. 2v1, it's okay. 2v1, no problem. That, that was that in. Thank you, Baresi. Thank you. Ah, <sighs> 7.5 for Baresi, one goal. How many possessions? Two, only two possessions, one. I think this is the least productive I've ever had a center back be. Out of every single center back review I've ever done, I think this is the least productive. All right, that's going to do it for Baresi. Uh, look, he's just okay at best, okay? um, It's just, I don't know. There's just something weird about him. That it's just, yeah, I don't know. He doesn't feel terrible. He doesn't feel heavy. He doesn't feel sluggish, which is nice. His acceleration is pretty terrible, even with the boost and the pace. It's it's still pretty terrible. Uh, defensively, he's not bad. His marking is very 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 good. Uh, I think that's defensive awareness now. Uh, it's it's very very good. Uh, you know, defensively, he can obviously he can defend. He he'll make interceptions. He'll make tackles. But there's just something about him that wasn't working. Unfortunately, this is the least productive I've been with a center back. I don't know why. It was just with him. Um, it's a shame, honestly, because uh, Baris is one of the greatest center backs of all time, and this, just the card just doesn't feel very, very good at all. I wouldn't feel comfortable having him in my back line if I'm being completely. I think that's the best way I can put it. I just would not feel comfortable having having him at all in my back line. I think I'd rather play with Nesta. If it was between Baris or Nesta, I'd definitely want to play with Nesta instead. But that's going to be it for the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And please do take care of yourselves, your children, and your families. And I'll see you guys in the next video.